guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you my November favorites. So if you want to see all the things that I was loving this month, then keep on watching and let's get into the video. So the first thing in my November favorites is actually my sunrise shell necklace. If you haven't noticed, I pretty much wear it in every video. When we went to Bali, um, if you watched my Bali 2015 video, a monkey actually like stole my necklace off of my neck. That was like my favorite necklace. My parents got it for me for my birthday like a few years ago. My boyfriend felt like really bad so he decided to get me a new one so I'm so happy. It doesn't look exactly the same because obviously like it's a shell so they're all unique. But I think this one is super super pretty and I'm so thankful that my boyfriend got me another one because he knew how much that necklace meant to me. Okay. Sorry, I had to get my dog from outside. So my next favorite is probably really random. You're gonna be like, what? Like, this doesn't belong in a favorites video. But it's actually this pencil. Since I was in about fourth grade, I would say, I've been using this Sumo Grip brand um, mechanical pencil. And it's really good. It makes your handwriting look so nice. Ever since I got into college, I think, um, like I lost all of my Sumo Grip pencils and I didn't bother like buying a new one. But this year I decided like, okay, I want another sumo grip. So I just picked up another one and yeah, so that's why it's in my favorites. My next favorite is this NYX Natural Eyeshadow Palette. I'm really iffy about drugstore brand eyeshadows. They're not very pigmented and like they don't stay on very well. But these shadows are so nice and they're so pigmented and they're really affordable because they are from NYX. So yeah, I've been loving that this month. My next favorite is a book. It's called The Life-Changing Magic of Tidying Up by Marie Kondo. It's not really like a novel or anything like that. It's more talking about how like um, cleaning up in your house and like your clothes, getting rid of things that you don't need will make you feel so much better in like your personal life and like mentally and spiritually. I read it and it really really inspired me to get rid of a lot of things that I don't need. Especially when it comes to clothes like that you get at like events or something. I feel like oh no like I can't get rid of this. Like who else is gonna wear this? Like I can't give this to Goodwill. Like no one's no one that was actually not at the event is gonna wear this shirt. So it just inspired me to like clean out my closet and just live like a more minimalistic life. My next favorite is actually this mascara. I've actually been using it probably I'd say for the past one or two years, I'm not exactly sure. But for the past couple months I actually lost it and I could not find it. And this month I found it again. It's the Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. And the tip looks like this. It's the best mascara like I've ever tried in my life. It doesn't clump up your lashes and it makes them really long and really full. So I've been really happy that I found this again this month. My next favorite is this journal. It's just like a regular journal. I thought it was like super, super cute. I got it from TJ Maxx. But I actually use it to write down all of my video ideas. This is really, really bad, but I kind of space out. I'm like, I stop paying attention to my professor sometimes. So when I do that, I really think about like what videos I want to do next. So I write them all down in here so I remember them. So my next favorite is this Olay Active Botanicals Refreshing Gel Cleanser. I got it free in my homecoming box box from Influencer. If you want to check influencer out i'll link them down below i have like combination skin but it does get really like used to products quickly so i always have to change up what i'm using so i love this it smells so good it leaves my skin feeling like really fresh and smooth and clean and i just know that it's working really well my next favorite i actually don't have it with me i forgot it at my boyfriend's house so i'll insert a picture right here a picture right here a picture right here the um L'Oreal Paris, I believe, Nutri-Gloss Nutri -Gloss High Shine Shampoo and Conditioner. I've been using this for, I want to say, like the past month, month and a half. And it really made my hair like so much shinier, so much softer. The only thing I did notice is that it does make my hair a little bit greasier, I guess. Or like, it gets greasier faster. Other than that, like, it leaves my hair so nice and so shiny, so... I've really been loving that. My next favorite is actually Made in the AM. Oh my gosh. So I'm such like a One Direction freak. I'm not even gonna lie. Like 
People make fun of me about it all the time, but I don't care. Like, those are my babies, and I love them. Made in the AM, to me, is just, like, on a whole nother level. Like, it's so, like, good. It, I don't know. It's amazing. History, yeah. End of the day, temporary fix, and AM. Those are my current favorites right now, and I've just been listening to it nonstop. I listen to it, like, on my way to school, on my way to work, like, in the shower, just, like, any time. That I have free time like when I'm doing my homework I will be listening to that album my next favorite like I don't have that with me either but it's the hot chocolate or the white chocolate hot chocolate from Starbucks it's not like um, a seasonal drink but I never tried it before until about two weeks ago and I've been obsessed with it it's like hot chocolate but a hundred times better I really wanted to try this hot chocolate because it sounded so good and I was right. It's so good. Like, I am obsessed with it. Like, I don't have any other words. You just have to try it. So my last two favorites I totally forgot about, but they're both candles. So the first one is Fresh Balsam, and the next one is Champagne Toast. So they're both from Bath & Body Works, and oh my god. Okay, let me just get started with Champagne Toast. It smells like mango and passion fruit mixed together it's so good and it's not it's fruity but it's not like too much it's supposed to smell like champagne nectarine and black currant but i don't know to me it smells like passion fruit and mango definitely recommend this one the next one is fresh balsam which legit like straight up just smells like a christmas tree like i'm not even lying to you <sighs> like it smells like i already have a christmas tree in my house but yes, so this is perfect. Especially, I would recommend this like if you get a fake tree and you can just burn this and it just smells like you have a real one. So those were all my favorites this month. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a thumbs up and subscribe down below. Let me know something that was your favorite this month in the comments as well. And I'll see you next week. Bye. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you how I edit my Instagram.